Wednesday and welcome to another episode of Quotes to Live By from Inspirational Goods. This week I picked a quote from Pope John the 23rd and his quote goes, Concern yourself not with what you tried and failed in, but with what it is still possible for you to do. And I think this is a really simple quote, um, but something that I wanted to just share this quick reminder for everyone. And it's so difficult sometimes, especially nowadays when we have so many different media outlets and social media at easy access where we can compare our lives to other people and we're always saying, well, I'm less than this or I haven't done something as big as them or I'm not as a success as they are. Um, and we tend to just kind of compare and we want more and we expect so much of ourselves and we forget about all the big and little things we really have accomplished and things that we should be proud of and give ourselves a little pat on the back about. Um, and instead we're, we're just looking for more and when we're thinking we're not enough and we focus on all the things that we, like Pope John says, have tried and failed in versus the things that is still yet possible for us to do. So we're looking at things more um, pessimistically instead of optimistically and into the future and and um, kind of like they say the glass is half empty versus seeing it the world as the glass is half full. So my challenge for everyone today is to really think about all that you are in this moment up to this point, all that you've accomplished, all the things you are proud of. Um, what are things that you feel proud that you've done? What are little accomplishments in your life that um, you, you get excited about and that have made you the person that you are today um, instead of thinking of all the things you are not and comparing? And that's so important to take time every once in a while to do. It helps to reset your mind and think about yourself in a more positive light, something that you can be really proud of and it increases our confidence about ourselves and it kind of puts you back in touch with who you really are and how far you've come. So, um, so please do this today. Take some time. Um, if it's five minutes while you're driving home from work, um, just think about all the things you're proud of yourself for, all the things you've accomplished. Um, and better yet, um, if you have time to sit down and write it in a journal, that's even better because it's something that you can reflect back upon and it's a running list of things that you can just keep adding to. Um, and overall, it just helps your mindset um, think of yourself for the better, all the things and possibilities that you still have yet to do, all the things you have accomplished versus thinking of the negative stuff, the comparison stuff, the things that you've tried and you've failed at. Um, and my, that is not bad either. I just wanted to say quickly is if you've tried and failed at something, that's okay. It's a lesson learned. Don't be down about it. You've learned, you can move on. Maybe it's not something that you're meant to do. At least you tried. Brush it off. So anyway, hopefully this was a really quick reminder um, and suggestion for everyone today. Just please think of all the things that you are proud of. Um, write it down. Um, take some time to think about it. Um, and uh, hopefully this was a little bit of positivity for your week ahead. And I look forward to seeing you with another episode of Quotes to Live By next week. Bye, everyone. Take care.